this thing doesn't feel Master Ball worthy. Especially when I have one more. Oh, that did a lot, actually. Um, I do have another Legendary Encounter before the Elite Four. So, I can save it for that. Five Pipers. Should. Yeah, perfect. Fancy double attack. Man, this has got like a. Oh, I killed it. I didn't mean to attack. Ah, uh, it's it's okay. Welcome to episode 16 of the Pokemon Fire Red Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. And we're really starting to get into the thick of the game. We are not that far from the end. Just two more gym badges to get and the Elite Four. Uh, I know there's like an island that we have to go to. I believe Moltres is there. Well, a randomized legendary. And right now we are going to go to the power plant but before we do let us do a quick team recap we have delia the alakazam serious nature huge power ability which is amazing it's not the best for alakazam because he is a special attacker one of the best special attackers there is so not the best ability for him but still pretty cool kinesis confusion disable and Psybeam on this alakazam and then next up our, uh, our staple of the team, we have Arnold the Dugong, Snore, Curse, Rest, and Aurora Beam, Rain Dish ability. Then we have Robbie the Blaziken, Insomnia ability, with Blaze Kick, Double Kick, Strength, and Bulk Up. And then we have our first legendary, Maurice the Suicune, who we caught in place of Articuno in the Seafoam Islands, kind of fitting. Bubble Beam, Rain Dance, Gust, Aurora Beam with the Drizzle ability, which is absolutely perfect. Could not have had a better ability. Uh, Lamont the Lapras with the Early Bird ability. Ice Beam, Rain Dance, Confuse Ray, and Surf. And last but not least, we have Asuka the Crobat, Sludge Bomb, Supersonic, Bite, and Fly with the Natural Cure ability. So that is our team. And we're going to go to the power plant. I believe there's some stat. We already got our encounter there. That was the Alakazam. Um, but I think there's some static encounters as well. As Of course, there's also the legendary. That would be Zapdos. But now we'll see. Who knows what it is. I'm really hoping for... I was thinking about this. I think my top two that I would want are, of course... <laughs> speaking of legendaries, are... Um, <clears throat> Rayquaza or perhaps a Groudon because I really don't have um, like Rayquaza is just amazing or I wouldn't be mad at Mewtwo either so those are the three that I would want the most I think but Rayquaza is just so good fluffy tail that's interesting oh okay Now I'm running into all these legendaries. Really, like, not. Oh, there he is. There he is, right there. You see him? <laughs> it's funny. No. All right. I don't know if there's multiple of these um, static encounters. Oh, okay. I think. It'll be fair for me to need to just choose one of them. Like, I don't know if I get to see them beforehand. We'll have to see. Okay, this is a static. Um, Sableye. What happens if I run from this? Does it stay there? Nope, it's gone. Okay. So. I think there's like three of them. 
so I'll just uh, I'll just try to catch the one that I think is the best. <clears throat> I sacrificed the sable eye, but I'm honestly not that mad. Guys, I redemption! I got hyper beam back. Yes. Hyper Beam is back, and this time I won't waste it on a Meowth. <laughs> what are the odds of getting the same TM multiple times in the same series? Probably pretty low. Okay, this is starting to get a little annoying. We got some repels, don't we? I would assume so. Oh, that's nice. Flee from any po battle with a wild Pokemon. It's a good ability. Very weird music in here. Where are these repels? I guess it doesn't count for this guy. He is a legendary to be fair. Some very interesting stuff in here. Okay, this is going to be a static, and it is Houndour. Interesting. I uh, look in the background. I got his uh, his dad back there. Mm. I'm gonna take this. I think. I think I'll risk this. It's dark type. It's fire. Mm. What to go to? Can't really hurt me with him, so. <clears throat> nice, one ball. I will take that. Uh, this is gonna be Marlene. I am a really big fan of Hound Doom. One of my absolute favorites from Gen 2. So, oh, okay. Oh my god, I cannot type. So, I'm really excited about that. Um, Dark is definitely a type I'm missing pretty much the whole game. So, yeah, pretty cool. And uh, not a bad thing to have that on my side. <sighs> There's a lot of... This place is filled with cool Pokemon. As this thing pops up, and I can't escape from it. Oh my god. two statics okay uh, I think it would be wise for me to use something else at the beginning of the party just in case so yeah I may not throw the master ball at this thing depending on what it is Jirachi not what I was hoping for uh, it does have a very interesting typing I have never had this thing before so yeah, let's. I can hit it. Doom Desire. I hope that doesn't like randomly just kill me in one shot. I have no idea what that is, so <clears throat> it's a little scary. Hmm. Rain Dance would normally be a great move for Suicune, but it's kind of useless since he has Drizzle already, so. Might as well get, I'll probably get rid of that at some point. Oh. Okay. Oh, it does nothing. No big deal. I think I could risk him with one of these. Should get him in the perfect health, unless it's a crit. Please don't get a crit. Alright, cool. He's in the red. Whatever. 
Doom Desire does barely anything. Let's test our luck with some Ultra Balls. This thing doesn't feel Master Ball worthy. Especially when I have one more. Oh, that did a lot, actually. Um, I do have another Legendary Encounter before the Elite Four. So, I could save it for that. Do I have Hypers? I should. Yeah, perfect. Fancy. Double attack. Man, this has got like a... Oh, I killed it. I didn't mean to attack. Ah, uh, it's, it's okay. <laughs> wow, that was really stupid. Uh, you know... That was dumb. It was really stupid, but it is what it is. Yeah, that happened. <laughs> it's all good. I probably would not have, I don't know, honestly. I would have to check a lot of stuff to see if I could get on my team, honestly. So, well, it's cool. It's all good. All right, let's fly to Pallet Town. We are going to now get the encounter, um, below Pallet Town. Let's take some healing. Just screw it. Why not? Alright, give me something here. Ooh, Grimer. Okay. Grimer's good. Very, very solid Pokemon here. Super effective. I think this would probably kill. Especially from someone, uh, you know, like a tank like him. Koska could probably do some damage. Muck could be very useful. He's a very, very good poison type. Um, very few weaknesses on poison types as well. Just psychic and ground. And they resist some, you know, they resist fighting and a couple other things. Alright. This is going to be Adela. Scary. I don't like this. Uh, I think Suicune could probably one-shot, though. 
He is a very high level. I'm gonna trust that Bubble Beam will one shot. It's almost 25 levels higher. <clears throat> yeah, okay. We're good there. I've never, ever been afraid of those things before until this series. Why not some Wob Effects are just a nuisance now. That is horrible. has like all magic carps or something which I hate when they do that it's so stupid I could probably kill all right close almost it was risky a little bit but I think it was worth it Oh my god, this thing is overpowered. Oh, I should have just... That's cool, that's cool. somewhere. I'll put them at the front of the party and let them try and double battle. See what happens. I'll give the Twisted Spoon to my boy. shouldn't allow this. Let's see what happens.
good. We're good. That was a little scary, but we're fine. That was a that was a dangerous thing, but it's cool. made a stupid move and put Asuka out there who is uh, not for, you know, Psychic is super effective on him, her, that would have, oh, Magic Belief, that's interesting, that would have killed, probably, leave me alone, I'm tired, oh no, that's annoying, there of uh, Encore, I mean. Oh, he stayed asleep. Surprised I haven't run into one yet. It's bugging flying. I'm just sitting now how weak I am to electric type, so my, that is, uh, not really great. So yeah, I wouldn't mind that Groudon for my next Legendary. Heal up Arnold. I don't know, I could just rest, but I'd rather not risk it. did a lot of damage. Let's not do that again. starting to really get up there. Like, not that I'm behind or anything, but... You know. It's nice as I have a level 50. I feel like that's a little bit ahead of schedule, too. Hmm. I 
I didn't read what that said. I really hope it wasn't a Rayquaza. Uh, because I didn't read it, I'm sending you out, just in case. Venonat. <laughs> I once again forgot that Venonat is not affected. Or that bodies are not affected by ice. I keep forgetting that they're not, you know, I keep thinking that the, the ice is super effective against them, and it's not. I don't know where I'm getting that from. It just makes sense to me. Like, oh, Dragon Rage would normally be very ter very terrifying. So many trainers. My goodness. not mess around with that. Oh, we're at Cinnabar Island already. So there is not an, a water encounter. That's interesting. But I can... I can get one. Now we have the fossil... What we got from that moon, and we have also the old amber. Oh, muck. Okay, I mean, it's dupes, but cool. for Dragonite. Oh, I wish. Oh my god, that would be amazing. Oh! Nose pass for Rayquaza? Oh! Just pray for there to be a nose pass in the, in the other fossil, the old Amber. I'll take the Dragonite too, but the Rayquaza will be... Ooh. Muck. Um, what did I name the first one? Adela. Yep. I'll, I'll just call this one. Adele. B. Um. Venonat. Meh. I mean, like, not horrible or anything, but... Uh, and this is... Sasha. Okay. Yeah, like at least two more encounters. I'm gonna choose to use the super rod here. Yeah. You know what? I'll surf. I'll I'll test my luck with surfing. They should be higher level here. They shouldn't be level fives or whatever. Why is this 
taking so long. It's taking forever. What's going on? I heard that. I don't know what it was. Or where. It was like... Here we go. Cloister, all right. Oh, it's level 10. Okay, I should have just used the super rod, but it's cool, because Cloister's, Cloister's solid, but, you know, not anything I was really, I'm really probably gonna use. but it's okay uh, I really wasn't worried about it uh, I have a lot of Pokemon on the PC right now so like I'm not you know I'm not stressing about that in the slightest all right let's get another encounter in here Give me something cool. Hey, I'll even take that nose pass. This is... Okay. I'm not going to fail this time. Because he's on my side. He's right behind me. I have another chance. This will not kill. You will not kill. Perfect. Oh my god. That's scary. I don't know what I... I don't think I can hit this. said earlier this is one of my favorites from gen 2 come on yes i may have failed to catch it in episode what was that four three no episode three but now i have it and i am thrilled to have it um this one is going to be dirk I really hope that has a good ability, because I will put that on my team right now. Uh, if you guys are joining the series, right above my head, you can uh, follow me on Twitch, on Instagram, on Twitter, and on Facebook at Rotten Plays. I try to be as active as possible on there, keep everyone updated with what I'm doing. I try to stream a lot on, as much as possible on Twitch. I've been a little bit behind, but I'm trying to get back on it. Uh, yeah, I really appreciate the support, and I hope you guys are enjoying this series as much as uh, I am enjoying making it. So, and that is a lot. So, you know, really appreciate everyone who watches. Leave some likes and comments on the videos. It's great. Adamant nature. I'm pretty sure that's up an attack, which isn't the best. Forecast changes with the weather. I don't really think that does anything. But that's okay. It's not really the end of the world. Thunder Punch, Thunder Blade, Thunder Shock. Like his regular attack's still pretty good. Um, yeah, I might, uh, I might make this my move because I really am weak to electricity. 
Let's see, Marlene, what about you? Blaze, that's really good. It's a, unfortunate it's not going to keep that. Marlene's special attack is pretty solid, too. Smog, Roar, Bite, Bonus, Sleuth. Um, what about you, Adela? Pick up. Okay, I'm mad about that. Oh, right, and the muck, which is level five. Adelba. Pick up. It, that's weird. It keeps the ability, unless it changes. But And Sasha. Rain dish. Eh. Not the best for that Pokemon. I'm torn. Like... Is it time to say goodbye? It might be. I have too many water types. This is a big dilemma, and I hate to do it. So, you know what? I'm not I'm not going to do it right now. Um, Asuka, what are you? Yeah. Everything's telling me that I should probably take, uh, uh, what's his name? Oh my god, I can't remember his name. That I should probably take, uh, Arnold off the team. Because he's probably the weakest... I have in terms of like, and I have, I already have the same typing with Lapras, but I just don't want to. He's been with me since the beginning, I just want to keep him, and I, I'm going to for now. Who can learn this? Oh my god, he can learn Hyper Beam. It's just ridiculous. What about Fly? Flying Ampharos, of course. That makes a lot of sense. I'm curious if there's any more encounters, but if not, I'm gonna go a couple of, uh, a little bit, around 20, yeah, I believe that's, let me just check, I'm pretty sure that is a new encounter though. See Foam Islands. Oh, it's not, okay, so that is it. I believe this is it for encounters until I get to Victory Road. So, yeah, I think I'm pretty much set then. Okay. Well, that is going to be it for this episode then, guys. We're going to head back to the Pokemon Center, as we always do. Uh, make sure I'm all healed up. And, yeah, that is it. So, thank you guys so much for watching. And take care, guys. Appreciate it.